all right hello everyone today i'm going to give you guys a tutorial on how to make an iphone on a simple iphone on on chip which is a free cat software all right let's begin so first we're going to go to the top face we're going to create a sketch option create a new sketch and select the, 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 the top surface so now we're going to take the corner rectangle start from the center and take it all the way to the top as so uh, let me just escape that okay so now we need to now we're going to want to give the rounded edges that an iphone has so we're going to choose the sketch fillet option and choose each of the four edges like this do that and we're going to make it 0 0.5 inches okay so now we have the rounded edges we can select the check mark as we're done with the sketch so now we're going to give now we're going to give the width to the phone using the extrude option select on it it's a bit too wide now so we're going to make it 0 0.3 inches there we go perfect check mark all right now let's go to the front face which is the bottom and we're going to add our speaker grills as well as our charging port so we're going to sketch we create a sketch on this plane take the center point circles one two three now we can make them equal by using this equal option so we'll make these two equal then we'll make these two equal now that they're all in equal size we can drag them around make them parallel equidistant from each other you guys can make it as perfect as you want this is enough for me so now we're going to use the construction construction tool click on that and the line option together and as you go across this line you're going to see this small box over here you press on that and you drag it all the way down to the box on the other side there we go just right click escape line so now instead of us drawing these again we can just use the mirror option so this is the mirror option choose the line of symmetry which is obviously our constructed line here we're going to take this this and this and there we have it so now that we're done with this we can uncheck that backspace on our construction line and now we're going to draw a line for our charging port so we're going to take the line draw it here like that and obviously the charging port is round so to give it that rounded effect we're going to press on this option so for you guys it might be on offset like this so what you're going to want to do is press on the drag down option or uh, drag down or drop down uh, select slot and press on it and if it might be on a different or uh, uh, number for you guys but i think 0 0.05 inches is the perfect one and to just uh, select we just click outside so now that we're done with this we can check mark that now we need to make these go inside so what we're going to do is extrude select each of these maybe make sure uh, make sure not to ho uh, select this surface just the speaker grills and the charging port so now we're going to remove instead of instead of add so this is how it normally is which will make it come out but now we're going to remove so it goes in we're going to make it 0 0.3 inches and perfect there we go all right so now that's how it's looking right now we're going to go to the top so now we're going to go to this side of the phone so we're going to go to the left zoom in sketch select the surface so now we're going to make our ringer as well as our volume up and down so for the ringer there's a small line uh, i want to i want to extend it a bit there we go now we're going to draw two more lines so one for the volume up and then the volume down all right escape time okay so now i'm um, gonna make each of these a bit longer okay and to make them equal we use the equal option select each of them all right so now that we're done now oh so we need to slot them slot each one of them to give them the rounded effect select finish the sketch now we're gonna extrude them so select extrude it's way too long right now so we're gonna make it zero point uh three inches no sorry zero zero point zero three inches there we go that's perfect done so this is what our phone's looking like right now we're going to go to the right side now for our power button now if you come here sketch select the surface select the line draw the line select the slot option slot it enter now we're done with this sketch we're going to take the extrude option click on it make it 0 0.03 inches and now we're done sorry guys i'm going a little fast you can pause and 
follow along. So now that we have this, let's focus on the main home screen. So we're gonna take. So now we're gonna go to the top, zoom in a bit. Sketch option, select the surface. Okay. So now we're gonna take a line, and over here. So between these two, you're gonna see this little dot. So you're gonna connect the two sides like this, and right click, escape this line, and you're gonna do the same thing at the bottom as well. So you're gonna see this dot and connect it to the other side. So first, we're, we're gonna draw our home button right about here. I think that's good. And we're gonna now draw our front facing camera and our speaker grill. Speaker grill. So we're gonna do this. Another small one. Uh, that, and we're gonna draw a line here. There we go. We're going to take the slot option and slot that. Okay. Now we're going to extrude these two surfaces, but not just a little little bit. So we're going to take these two surfaces. I'm gonna we're gonna extrude them 0.01 inches. So it's not noticeable, but it's still extruded. Okay. So now that it's like this, what we're going to do? We're gonna right click on the home. Home button, we're gonna select add appearance to face, appearance to face. We're gonna select black because that's what a home sorry, we're gonna select gray, sorry, and we can select use that gray color for all of this. Alright, select that. And obviously these three, so we're gonna zoom in. One, two, three. We're gonna add appearance to three faces and make them black. Like that. Alright. So now that we're done with this. Oh yeah, we, did we just add the color to our home screen as well? We'll make it black. Right click, add appearance, and you make it black. Alright. So now that all this is done, what we're going to do is... I personally I personally love the red iPhone, so what we're going to do is uh, make the phone red. So we have to choose each and every surface now. Like this, one, two... Instead of making them individually, we can choose them like this. Obviously the power buttons and the ringer also have red. We're gonna go to the top, select, 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 select. There we go. Uh, zoom in, select. For the for the power buttons and the volume buttons and stuff, you might you might have to zoom in to make sure you get exactly this this whole thing, not the edges. You need the center. So now that we have all of that, what we're gonna do is right click, add appearance to all eleven faces, and choose red. Alright guys, there we have it. This is the red simple iPhone. Oh, I missed I missed uh, I missed the color one section. Alright. Oh, one more section. Okay, so for this section, make sure you select that and add appearance. Red. Alright guys. So there we have it. This is the, the red iPhone or a simple iPhone. You guys can choose whatever color you want. Um this is how it is. It's done. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed and uh, please subscribe, leave a like and I'll see you next time. Thank you.